Today we're gonna talk about virtual reality or what is called VR, which is one of the most important technologies of the modern era. Although it is not a new technology as some might think, this can actually lead you as an artist to new territories and expand your experience. The rapid technological development has provided a great service to this tech, as virtual reality allows you to experience things that might be difficult for a person to experience in the real world. Basically, virtual reality is a computer technology that provides a three-dimensional environment surrounding the user and responds to his actions in a natural way, where you can interact with digital content as if it is in the same space as the person. You can be transported to another place or time explore incredible new worlds, and even meet with people who don't actually exist. As I can see it, the potential of virtual reality is now almost limitless, and the technology is quickly becoming accessible to the public. This virtual reality can be experienced from a VR headset to allow you to see the world surrounding you. So what makes the development of virtual reality useful? The answer is that the potential of the entertainment value is very clear. For example, movies and video games are good examples and ultimately the entertainment industry is worth many billions of dollars and consumers are always keen on it. And virtual reality, as many other technologies, is used in architecture, sports, medicine, arts, education and more. Although gaming is for the moment the most obvious use case for VR, I would say it is capable of so much more. Artists and creatives all over the world are using VR for a wide range of artistic fields, including 3D modeling, animation, painting, drawing, and sculpting, just to name a few. There are a lot of software and apps now that allow you to test your creativity in VR and express your ideas flexibly to a certain extent. For example, VR software are now becoming more intuitive and becoming easier to use over the years, so artists are using them to create different things and work on different projects. One of the companies interested in developing this tech is Google, which is serious about getting on board with the artistic community. They are working with tens of artists to explore and improve the current tools available. With virtual reality, 3D models and sculptures can be drawn, sculpted, created, and animated. And this technology allows a virtual tour in a 3D space from one place to another. And the main strength of this is that it allows you to see places from 360 degrees and explore its elements and its 3D dimensions in a way that allows interaction with 3D scenes through hotspots and this is different from just participating in a video presentation on the screen. And this way, art can be conveyed to the mind in an attractive way, as it enables the participant to move and roam within the scene, which helps them develop their ability to visualize, understand and perceive the artist's complex ideas and creativity as well, which cannot be understood in two dimensions. Furthermore, it provides the ability to attract users to see more of the scene and provide a specific artistic feel and emotion that cannot be expressed within traditional tools. I think VR has now a lot of potential, and if you are a 3D artist, I believe this is gonna be useful for you in the long term or even in the short term, whether it be for creating video games, films, or anything else, and you can participate in this if you have the right skills and you are willing to dive into it right now. At least in the entertainment field, it is making waves and it is seeing a lot of success. And I believe as an artist, you can have a lot of fun with this technology. I hope you found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.